a Dear Media original podcast. Today's episode is brought to us by ButcherBox. I am so in love with this company. I think that it's so nice to have some decisions that are already pre-made for you. In my household, chicken is a love language. I do it all different ways, but the most special way I do is braised chicken. And I think the reason why it's so special is that it takes a little bit of time. It's longer than just kind of like your casual weeknight meal. It takes like an hour and a half to make. I made it recently with my butcher box chicken thighs, and it was phenomenal. The thing about ButcherBox is that you're always going to get 100% grass-fed beef, free-range organic chicken, pork raised crate-free, and wild-caught seafood. It's always humanely raised and no antibiotics or added hormones, and I just really trust them. It's delivered straight to your doorstep, free shipping always, and they offer curated to customized box plans, which I love. The other thing is there are a variety of really high quality cuts at an amazing value. There are exclusive member deals and there are recipe inspiration guides and tips and hacks, which I absolutely love. Sometimes it's really nice to just have someone really give you a guide of what you should make for you. It takes the pressure off of having to know what you're going to make every week. And I've gotten some great ideas from them. ButcherBox is giving us a special deal. Sign up today using the code instinct to receive ground beef for a year plus $20 off your first order. That's two pounds of ground beef free in every box for a year plus $20 off your first order when you sign up at butcherbox.com slash instinct and use the code instinct. Hi, welcome to Good Instincts. I'm Shira Barlow, but you may know me as the food therapist. Join me every Monday through Friday for bite-sized episodes designed to help you close the gap between where you are right now and where you want to go. This should feel good, like really good. And it will, I promise. Okay, so we had done this whole episode on berberine and people were very into it. If you haven't listened, it is a natural supplement that people are calling nature's ozempic because it works on the same receptors in the body to decrease blood sugar. And then I had a couple listeners ask me about another supplement and it is in the same category. And like berberine, it is talked about a lot because of how closely it resembles the prescription drug metformin. And it is used a lot to help people manage their blood sugar and with insulin sensitivity and with hormones, especially for people with PCOS. So just to give like a little overview of what it is, it is basically a sugar that is both formed in the body and it is also found in certain foods like beans and nuts. And in the body, it basically helps with communication between cells and the response that we have to hormones and neurotransmitters. And it actually used to be considered part of the B vitamin family, and it was called B8. There are actually nine different forms of inositol, but there's two that are most studied. There's myo, and then there's d And then within that, the myo-inositol is the one that is studied the most. So in addition to helping with blood sugar control, it has also been found to be quite helpful in terms of fertility. There was actually one study that found that it improved the quality of not just the embryos, but the pregnancy rates in women, even without PCOS, that were using IVF. And it's often used in conjunction with folic acid. And in a study of 3,600 women with PCOS who were experiencing a lot of fertility issues, myo-inositol plus folic acid was found to really promote ovulation and pregnancy rates. And in a subgroup of people who were undergoing IVF, it was found to be beneficial for fertilization rates. So it is thought that one of the reasons it really helps with those things is because it helps balance hormones like estrogen and testosterone and androgens, which have a huge impact on fertility, especially for ovulation. And there is also a good amount of evidence that shows that it could actually be really helpful with fertility for men. So that is in terms of improving not just the level of the sperm production, but also the motility of the sperm. And one study that was in the International Journal of Reproductive Biomed in 2019 found that myo-inositol was found to impact both the concentration and the motility of sperm enough to increase the chance of fertility. The thing about this, especially in terms of both 
the hormone control and the blood sugar control is you may be tempted to just like go out and buy this on your own. I do think that this is something you really have to talk to your doctor about because taking too much could really throw off your hormone levels because it can lower estrogen. And that's why it's so helpful for people with PCOS. You could also lower estrogen if you were taking so much of it to a point that you don't want. And having the right amount of estrogen is really important for the body, for instance, for protecting our bones and preventing against breast cancer. Also, it is really important to pay attention to the ratio of the myo version and the D-Cairo version. The ratio that I found most recommended was 40 to 1. I did find a supplement that I thought was really cool. It's from a company called Parallel, and it's the PCOS support. So they have that exact formulation of 40 to 1 of the inositol, and it also has berberine. But I really do think this is something you should talk to your doctor about if you're interested. I also think it could really help. And that's really exciting, especially with people with PCOS and fertility issues. And it's natural, which is great. So thank you to the listeners that asked about this. I think this is really important conversation. And let me know what you think. Let me know if you're thinking about taking this or you are taking this or if you have any other things you'd like me to break down. You can always find me on Instagram at cheer underscore RD. And tomorrow is going to be a shit I'm loving. I'll see you there. Thank you so much for listening to Good Instincts. Hosted and written by me, Shira Barlow. You can find me on Instagram at Shira underscore RD. Good Instincts is a Dear Media Daily. Today's episode is brought to us by ButcherBox. I am so in love with this company. I think that it's so nice to have some decisions that are already pre-made for you. In my household, chicken is a love language. I do it all different ways, but the most special way I do is braised chicken. And I think the reason why it's so special is that it takes a little bit of time. It's longer than just kind of like your casual weeknight meal. It takes like an hour and a half to make. I made it recently with my butcher box chicken thighs, and it was phenomenal. The thing about butcher box is that you're always going to get 100% grass fed beef, free range organic chicken pork raised crate-free and wild-caught seafood. It's always humanely raised and no antibiotics or added hormones, and I just really trust them. It's delivered straight to your doorstep, free shipping always, and they offer curated to customized box plans, which I love. The other thing is there are a variety of really high-quality cuts at an amazing value. There are exclusive member deals, and there are recipe inspiration guides and tips and hacks, which I absolutely love. Sometimes it's really nice to just have someone really give you a guide of what you should make for you. It takes the pressure off of having to know what you're going to make every week. And I've gotten some great ideas from them. ButcherBox is giving us a special deal. Sign up today using the code INSTINCT to receive ground beef for a year plus $20 off your first order. That's two pounds of ground beef free in every box for a year plus $20 off your first order when you sign up at butcherbox.com slash instinct and use the code instinct.